Every June, there's a group of people who come to Pigeon Forge. They've come for the Smoky Mountain Storytelling Festival. One of the folks behind this event is Elizabeth Rose, a Tennessee storyteller herself, and she keeps alive this tradition that is so much a part of the region's history. Who comes to storytelling festivals? Everybody comes to storytelling festivals. There is no age limit. You, when, when you go to a storytelling festival and you look around, you're going to see young to the very old because it's for everyone in all ages. I see storytelling in this part of the country as a real tie to tradition and history. That's right. People who first came to this area uh, as the, the early settlers in the Appalachian uh, Mountains, they brought their stories with them. And when you come to Pigeon Forge, you can just visualize those early settlers up there on their front porch swapping tales and telling lies and sharing big stories. We're right here in the mecca of where the storytelling really, I want to say, began here because those are the, the folks that brought the stories and those are some of the stories that you still hear at this festival. This is a very unique festival in, in the way that you can come and just listen to stories and spend most of the day listening to stories by professional storytellers and there's an opportunity for novice storytellers. It's called a swapping ground where they can sign up to share a story just to try out their wings at the storytelling and and to see how their story goes. So here you have the opportunity to just listen. You can tell a story yourself or you can attend workshops and the workshops are given by the featured storytellers and the workshops are on topics such as how to develop a story, how to perform the story, where you find stories, I've had people come here who said, well, my wife drug me here, but they sat and listened to every story and became storytelling enthusiasts. You mentioned youth storytellers. What's the, what's the health of storytelling? What's the, the future of this art form? The future is very bright. We invite these storytellers from all over the United States, and they are incredible, from grades three through senior in high school and they can tell a tale. People are just amazed when they see these youth on stage and they compare them to these nationally known tellers and they walk out of there saying storytelling is alive and well because these youth are phenomenal. Elizabeth Rose from the Smoky Mountain Storytelling Festival. We're glad you're with us to talk about this great event. This is Tennessee Time in Pigeon Forge.